Welcome to WebStarters. How to add products to cart via Ajax in WooCommerce. Not just that, how to update cart count via Ajax. Usually when you get a WordPress theme, it has this functionality. But when you develop a theme, then you have to add this functionality yourself in most cases. In any case, if your WordPress theme does not add products to cart using Ajax and does not update cart count via Ajax, then this tutorial is for you. Without Ajax, page will reload when you add product to cart. And cart count won't show updated number of products in cart unless you reload the page. I have this barebone theme without any styles and scripts. It's basic starter theme for WordPress usually used in WordPress theme development. I'm using underscores theme. Okay, let's go to shop page. If I click at add to cart from any product, product is added to cart via Ajax without reloading page. Let's go to a single product. Here if I click add to cart button, the page is reloaded. Here product is not being added to cart using Ajax. Let's fix this. To do it quickly and easily, go to plugins, click add new, search for WPC Ajax add to cart for WooCommerce or just search for Ajax add to cart for WooCommerce. Install and activate the plugin. There are other such plugins as well. Activate and that's it. Reload the page. Click add to cart. Now product is being added to cart via Ajax. No more page reload. Go back to shop. Add to cart. Add to cart. Everything's fine. You can style this link to look like this button by using CSS, by the way. Okay, we have fixed first problem. Second problem is to display cart count and update it via Ajax. We can display cart count beside this last link, above cart link, or anywhere in the page. To do that, go to Appearance, Theme File Editor. Let's go to Theme Header. I'm using a simple link here before header ends. It's got a link. It will link to cart page echo site underscore url slash cart and it's got the code to display cart count echo wc means woocommerce cart get cart contents count update file reload the page and here is the cart count let's add product to cart add to cart and product was added to cart but our count is 18 reload now it's 19 reload it is 19 add to card okay it is not being updated via ajax to apply ajax for this i will use a different approach i will remove this link and here i should use class and this is the code that i want to use items count i will store the count in a variable and display it when card has products Otherwise, it will display zero. Update file. Then I will go to functions.php file. At the bottom, I will use this code. We will add filter wc refresh mini card count function after ruby start. This is the same variable and this is the same code that is here. Here we define the variable and use a span class mini card count and then php echo inside it. It's same here. Update file. Okay, now here we have got 24. Reload. Add to card. And now it's 25. 26. 27 okay now this is working but what if we want to show card count in menu over a link like what if i want to show this card count here top of this card link for that we'll need to run code in menus and menus don't accept code but menus can accept short code if we enable short code for menus to do that we'll need to create short code in functions file 
So here I am adding another block of code. Add filter, WP nav menu items, do short code. And then add short code. Then we've got this function, book hard count. This is our short code now. And it has got exactly same code. Items count and then span with class mini card count. It is exactly the same like this. Update file. We need both code blocks, this one and this one. This code block is for short code. Now we can use this short code in menus. But notice that we added filter to allow short code in nav menus. This one. Without this, short code will not work in menus. So now we'll go to menu. And for cart, expand this link. And here we can use the short code WooCart count inside brackets. Save menu. Then we'll go to header file, header.php. This was our previous code. We have created short code. So I will prefer to use short code in menu and everywhere else now. So we will just remove this previous code and add code that will run this short code in PHP because this is template file now. So echo do underscore short code and then the short code inside it. But for now, I will comment it from header file to show you card count above this link. Reload and here is the card count. So add to card and it's being updated. Add to card, it's being updated. So card count in menu is working. Now we will uncomment this code from header. To show you that we can also display this count anywhere in template as well. Now here is the card count and this is card count again. Now these both will be updated via Ajax. Add to card, add to card, it's being updated. Second one is also updating. So place the short code anywhere you like multiple times if you need in your theme in any page it will work and card count styling like this depends on your css like we have this css file and i have added some code to style that card count balloon nav menu anchor and here this is important position relative nav menu anchor mini card count position absolute this is the CSS that I'm using to style this card count and circle. So once again, in my header.php file, I'm running this short code via PHP and in functions.php, we have got two code blocks. This code block is to create the short code. We enabled short code for nav menu items. Then we created short code and this is the content for the short code. And this is exactly the same that is in second code block here. Items count and this span with same class, mini card count, mini card count. Use both of these code blocks and use short code to display card count anywhere. And this is how we can add products to card via Ajax and update card count via Ajax in WooCommerce. And I should mention, to add products to cart via Ajax, there are more than one plugins. Like I showed you WPC Ajax Add to Cart for WooCommerce. This plugin. There's also WooCommerce Ajaxified Cart or Ajaxified Cart WooCommerce. And if we search for WooCommerce Ajax Cart, We've got this plugin, WooCommerce Ajax Card plugin. All of these can enable Add to Card via Ajax functionality in your WooCommerce site. And about the code, we've got this website, WPBGS. Add a WooCommerce cart icon to menu with the cart item count. And it's got this code to create short code, filter to enable Ajax on the card count. Add cart icon to an existing menu.
code to add cart i can buy itself and some css and from stack overflow we've got this ajaxify header cart items count in woocommerce we've got this resource this code is using id i used class these two resources can help to understand this code as well but i will also share code link used in this tutorial in video description as well get the code link from video description okay i hope it helped like share subscribe and i will see you in the next video